Hello guys, Code here and today we are going to develop an app known as Calculator and in this calculator the only thing that the calculator does is it adds it adds anxieties anyway and a full disclaimer I am noob into Kinder or some people call it Kinder and also call it Kinder without T I'm a noob and I just learned it about an hour ago so I'm trying to make it again and you guys can watch me make it again. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to import all the things from the Kinder. Kinder oops from the Kinder import all. And let's open a window. TK. I think this is wrong. TK. Yep. And let's add the title of the video. Sorry. <laughs> I'm a YouTuber. Anyway, let's add the title of our calculator to be Basic Edition Calculator. And after that, let us make a entry box. Entry root. Uh, let's add width. Let's make it fifty. Let's add border width, and let that be ten. Sounds good. And let's add that to our window. Our grid. Hmm. Bro equals to one, column equals to zero. Let's do that and let's run this. Hmm. Hmm. I forgot to add this, but I do not know what exactly the problem is. Let me search to the internet what exactly the problem is. Yep, I found the problem. It lies right here. Hope that works now. Yep. We've got to do this. Now it's got to work. These mosquitoes. Yes, it did work. After that, now we're going to add the buttons of our calculator. There will be... Hmm. 10 buttons, which are numbers. <laughs> Button, root, uh, text equals to 1, and size, padax equals to 40. Yeah, that'll be very big. 30. Pad y equals, pad y equals to Yeah, we gotta make it 30. Let's add this for nine more times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And after that, let's do two, three, four, five, six, seven, oops, seven, eight, nine. We gotta do zero as well. 0 and text 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 0. And now let's put all these things at mosquitoes are biting me quite a lot. Hope they're enjoying my blood. See our ID grid. Row equals to two, column equals to zero, and let's add this for nine times. Hmm. 
one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now it's good. So the first three numbers in the calculator will be nine at seven. Yeah, before that, we gotta do this. Two, three, four, five, six. Oops, mistake. Six, seven, eight, nine, zero, not ten, zero. So I think nine will be at column two. Yep, sorry, row two. It will be column one, similarly, column two. And six will be, yep, fine, column zero, one, two. Uh, these will be at column three, 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 and fine, zero, two, one, and four, 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 and zero, and this will be at column five, sorry, row five, yep, hope this works now. Yeah, yes it did, but we're having a bit of space here. I think I can, but I've done, hmm. Hmm. anyway, I'll find the solution in the middle if I can, if I cannot, do mention them in the comment section. So. I think the thing that we need to do now is we're going to make command for those command of exactly what happens once the user clicks on those buttons. So we will write button click and what we're going to do is I think we need to first up dot end equals to e dot get and what e dot get sorry i think e dot delete zero i think syntax is correct and e dot insert hmm number sorry Yep, it's number. Yeah, it's SDR number. We've got to make that string. If you know what string is, I hope you guys know. String plus. Hmm. Yeah, I think or it should be first, should appear first before SDR. <laughs> Should be SDR correct. I hope the syntax is correct. Is it capital though? I made a mistake. Oh no, yep. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, this feels good. Let's go for command equals to lambda. Then click. Let's add one. And let's copy this with comma let's add it right there well a child is crying the neighbor's son is crying to be precise i hope everything is good there i don't want you guys to listen to the child crying because nobody likes to hear a child cry l a m o oh shit b B A B B B B B B. Let's 
c5. Oh yeah. <coughs> Sorry for me coughing. And let's do, oops, that's what I wanted to do. Let's do two, let's do three, let's do four, let's do five, let's do six. And let's do seven, let's do eight, let's do nine. I found another mistake that I made, and that will be this. Oh. Hmm. Not working. Insert missing one required positional argument string. What does that even mean? Hmm. Let me search through the internet now, and we'll come back to you. Found it. You gotta specify where to insert it, right? We're going to insert it from the start. Yeah, it's working. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Sorry, that's one. Okay, <laughs> here's a problem. Hmm. I can fix that. There's button one. Button two should be so I think I ate pretty messed up everything. Nine seven, yeah, it's fine. Working good now. And after this but before that, guys, my laptop is making quite loud noise. It's like flying, flying an airplane. So I think I need to fix that. As you guys can clearly see, quite a lot of my CPU is being currently used by OBS Studio to, you know, record this session and then it's making quite a long 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 no, loud 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 noise what the hell is wrong with me I want this sound to go let me wait for a while <coughs> I'm quite not sure if this sound will go or not this loud sound will go or not because I don't see my CPU uses going down anytime soon and I just heard the sound being more violent. I hope everything off my computer is working good. Anyway, let's move on to our programming. So we've just added or like written a code uh, to show or display the number that the user has clicked on. After that, we need to add an add button. Right, so let's copy this for now. Control C, Control V. Let's go for add. And text will be like this. Maybe, yeah, no, not little, but this will be a little bigger. Right, and I think we'll, yeah, we're gonna create a new command for that. So let's now write def button add and what we're going to do is yeah before this button add let us create a clear function. Let's copy this paste that and should be clear. Should be 
clear. Uh, I think these are fine for the moment. Yeah. Let's add its size. I'm going to create a command for that. So before addition button, this would be EF button. I don't know how much of a noise you guys are listening of my fan rotating very violently. We're going to do this E dot delete zero till end. Yep. Yeah, and then we also need to add button and button clear with no parentheses and button. What? Read. So let's create new row for clear button in column equals to two, not one. Sorry, not to one. Okay, let's first we'll be adding one. Sorry, add. So guys, I want to the thing I want to say it's say is it's twelve point one nine a.m. and I'm writing code. And I might blabber some words which I do not mean to because it's very late and my brain wants to rest. But I would work. Hmm. Expected and intended. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hmm. Let's comment that out for a while. Oh, Is that the problem though? No, it's not. Button here. Hmm. Oh yeah. Found it. Yep, here it is. So let's go for nine, eight, seven, six, five. Clear. Oh, yeah. Yep, that goes. That is what I wanted. Anyway, let's now add the button add, right? Hmm. So let's go for. Yeah, what I want to do here is. I want to save the numbers which are present in that entry box firstly. Okay, let's do that. I R S T first number equals to e dot get right uh, and then I want to delete the content of present in that entry box so that user can add the numbers that they want to add yeah let's go for global f num no yep first n equals to first number Hmm. And E dot delete from beginning till the end. And after that, add it right here. Be you brought to that, brought to that. 
button add dot CRI degree row equals to six column equals to zero. Okay, this is good. Let's go for one plus zero. Okay, so the thing that we need to do now is create an equals to button. Control C. Equals. And this is equals to. And. Mm, yeah. Just create a new command. See, guys, I told you, I'm not slept. And I do not know what I'm writing, what code I'm writing now. Equals to, yeah. Button equals. Hmm. If you guys don't believe it's midnight, I'll show you that it's actually midnight at the end of the video. Uh, what equals to does is it gets what is at the screen first second number equals to e dot get and after that it deletes zero and and after that it inserts I am the first number. Oh, sorry. First N F I S F I R. First N. Second number. I hope this works. Yeah, we got to add the button. Button equals equals yeah. row equals to six column equals to two so it's two nine let's do let's go for zero let's go for mistake man mistake hmm that in so our error is insert zero missing one required position argument string Everything's good till now. So let me see. I think this is already stream. Possibly. Possibly. Six zero. Hmm. Also put it up in S I N T and string. So this must be okay. I can do that. I can define first time. Zero plus zero equals so guys let me search through the internet about this and we'll come to you very soon i think i found the error the same error that i made in the beginning of the video 
specifying from where we need to insert data to the entry box. Quite silly of me. Zero plus zero equals. Oh yeah, clear. Oh yeah, clear works. Five plus two. If, oh well. Oh yeah. So <laughs> basically, what this is doing is this is doing the string concatenations, which we do not want to do. So I think. Sorry. I think it needs to work now. Zero plus zero. Please show me only one zero. Hmm. It's a work now, man. It's a greedy work. Zero plus zero. Yep, it's all zero. I hope it's all zero. Let's clear that. Let's do two plus zero gives. What? Let's do eight plus thirty two. Everything is fine, guys. That should be forty. It worked. Thank you, guys. Thank you for being until the end. My video and I, as promised I'm going to show you that it is the midnight I hope you guys can see the time it's 0 0.33 it's half past midnight I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I don't know if I'll sleep now or write code to add the addition multiplication sorry I already had my addition write code to add multiplication, subtraction, division for now and then maybe afterwards. Anyway, see you guys at the next video. Bye.